Look at this shit. Holy shit. First low test. No scrape for shit. Come on, in and out. That was what is up, everybody? Welcome back to the second part of me slamming my truck. Well, I guess it's not gonna be slammed, but it's gonna be swallow for sure. Um, in the last video, you guys saw me doing uh, me and the homie Eddie doing the stitching six-inch flip kit in the rear, which made the truck out of ten-inch rear. So right now, um, I'm, at, I'm at a zero ten. But the problem was, um, well, if you guys haven't seen the last video, go check it out. Uh, I'll show the whole process of the six inch flip kit and uh, some problems we ran into, which is why I'm here driving a zero ten drop. I have to go back home and get my 22s because these stocks are 16s and the new drop spindles will not fit inside. Um, so I gotta go get the 22s and drive over back so we could finish the front and uh, the drop will finally be done hell yeah I'm excited I'm um, just in and out gonna pick up some uh, food for my girl and then I'm gonna head back over with the 22s god damn I'm excited after this is gonna be the front end so stay tuned guys if you guys are new to the channel please leave a like comment subscribe see you very soon all right we're about to hit this curb let's see what happens again fuck I kind of hope I scrape but then I don't at least my exhaust pipe. Maybe once I'm uh, dropped in the front, it'll, it'll scrape good. But this car needs to fucking move. There's no one coming. Yep, no scrape at all yet. Shit. Look at that. Alright guys, let me just... Get the rims and we'll be out of here. God damn, look at that. Holy shit. Alright, let's load these rims up. Okay, so we got the we got the 22s in the back. About to head back to Eddie's house and um, finish the front. Be a 510, oh 410, and um, yeah, put the rims back on and uh, oh yeah, the truck suspension is almost done. Pretty much for a bit. So let's go. Uh, what else? What else do I gotta say? From the whole trip here, the truck feels good with the new shocks and the extenders and everything. It's, it's a smooth ride. But, uh, all right, let's go. God damn. Up next, Denali front end. God damn, look at this shit. <laughs> For those of you that haven't seen the first video, I request, I uh, suggest you go watch that one first, and then uh, then come back to this one. So see you in a bit. Come back. Are finally back on the truck. I 
missed it. Much garbage. All right, so in case you guys missed it in the last video, what we're doing in the front is, uh, I was gonna do two inch springs, but uh, I'm training him. Shout out to uh, Eddie for the three inch springs. So I'm gonna do three inch and then two inch shackles. I mean, uh, spindles. spindles. There you go, there you go. <laughs> well, I mean, I already have two inch shackles in the back, but spindles. So just uh, sit down and learn. Let me show you the, let me show you the, the parts real quick. Here's the three inch drop springs and the two inch drop spindles. God damn. God damn. If you guys haven't seen any of my other videos, we got the got the long tube headers, the the intake. Uh, working on getting on get the, getting the fans on and tuned and yeah. Like, comment, subscribe, leave a comment, leave any questions down, I got you guys. And uh, hopefully by next time you guys will see me with a front end Denali swap. I was so scared going to do it. Because the, the spring has so much compression in it. Uh-huh. 18. Uh, oh, I might fuck this clip up. This clip's never. Oh, this thing's been taken off before. Oh, all right, nice. Yeah, look, those headlights. So it doesn't come have <laughs> hoop caps. Yeah. Do you, do you hear yourself? Everybody talking? fucking clams up because I only took a video on that side because it has hoop caps. <laughs> yeah, hold on. You're using the hoop caps for the hoop Oh hell yeah, brand new. Yeah, brand new, bro. That's what I'm talking about. If you guys want to buy this, uh, hit me up and I'll uh, send it to you. 50 bucks. 50 bucks? Damn, son. All right, all right, 45. <laughs> all right, that's what <laughs> Brand new uh, AC Delco. Uh, yep. Yeah. OEM. All right, guys, so let's check out these new shocks. Sick. Look at this shit, bro. Damn, son. That's what you're getting? Oh yeah. Yo, what are you doing? I'm breaking stuff, bro. You saw that right there? Fully, fully built, son. I know what. You're gonna try sitting here with wheel. That's what you're gonna yeah. do. Yeah. Look like my cello cut. Oh, it's on. It wasn't me. Oh, yeah. 20 bucks oh. a day? Oh, no, my insurance has to has something to do with it. Yeah, that means it. Uh, yeah, it happens for me, you ain't gonna cover it. Well, nothing better happen. Because if not, you're, gonna, you're fucking getting dragged out to the side, side of the street, boy. Godless. I'll put it like that. I'll be here for your lawyer. Fuck, bro, you those, caught me, dude. Those, those are the rear shocks. What are you doing? I, I was just gonna put this one in there. No wonder the back felt weird. Hello. Hey. guys my camera's at 7% so just gonna show you the finished product after she's gonna die yeah it's about to it's at 7 there's some of this some of this son the same size gonna look the same true 
Actually, now, bro, the other one I'm using is two inch spring. So, on one side you have four, on the other side you have a five. Oh, uh, if anything, you should have done two here and then three on the other side. Because the gas tank's over here, bro. Oh, yeah, for a different lean, bro. Uh, yeah. You feel me, son? You guys put a different lean on this shit. Finishing up this side. How was the process, bro? Pretty good, bro. Hot as fuck. That's the only thing I made it kind of suck for. Yeah, it was pretty hot today. On the way home, I think it was like 90. 90, I checked on the the thermostat shit. 90 degrees. Now, now it's feeling like California fuck. That's it, bro. That's what it's gonna do. Already, already. I'm probably gonna have to get um some some different tires though. She's gonna rub crazy. ASAP. Where are you ready? 295s? You ready, son? You gotta Let's get go. like 245, 45. Fuck, what the fuck? Oh shit. I told you this. God damn. Oh, that shit might rub. Yeah? Oh, this shit. This tire looks like it's sticking out, huh? Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, you still didn't do that it. Yeah, but... Fuck. Uh, what's it look like? <laughs> oh, shit. I just need to get some fucking smaller tires. Fuck. Uh, I'm gonna take my fucking bumper off. God damn. I'll get back to you guys once I charge my camera. Go for it, the baby one.
I wasn't gonna be able to get home like that. So we put the stocks back on in the rear and we had no choice but to run these in the front and kind of smash the dent as much as we can right here, the fender line. So I could at least clear it enough to get home. Uh, with these tires and this setup right here, I cannot turn for shit. I, I can't make any type of wide turn. I could barely turn good without it rubbing or anything. Well, actually it rubs right away, but like, look, my freaking, my fender liner is already loose because of how, how, it, how it rubs already. Um, I'm probably gonna have to remove that. Well, I'm gonna have to get any smaller tires for sure. So that's that's next for the truck instead of um, the front end swap. Little little hiccup in the road, but that's okay. When we first dropped it, we put the the stocks in the back and these in the front. We drove it for a little bit. That's right before I did the little burnout, and just going straight, no bumps, no nothing, going slow. It it was already rubbing on on the the fender, so we smelt the the burnt tire and everything so right away we knew we have to come back and either borrow somebody's 17s or 20s or something or or um clear it enough to get home so that's what that's what we did we cleared it enough because nobody was available nobody had any 17s or 20s um shout out to eddie at underscore low sierra underscore for helping me get home and uh making it possible and everything so that's what we ran into. So don't run 305s. We knew that from the start, but I had to get home. So that's that's what happened. And um, so next up, I'm gonna get some tires for the truck. At, at least some cheap ones, just so I could be able to drive it around and uh, do a little video shoot, photo shoot with it. Cause like this, I can't run. I can't I can't uh, drive it around because I can't turn. That's that's dangerous. I can't turn. When I got home, I set up my camera over in the corner, like the little clip of me driving into the driving into the driveway um, and I, I freaking ran because because my camera was about to die it was it was already dying so so yeah so right after this I'm gonna do the giveaway for the decal if you guys have not entered go ahead down in the description put um hashtag Frankie Dinky hashtag um, big old chubs hashtag big old crew to get entered and I will choose the winner the winner in the next video um, but for now leave some comments of what you think of the drop um, this thing, I love it. Just got to get smaller tires so I could run my rims and the truck is, suspension is done. What do you guys think? Look at that. That's, that's beautiful right there. God damn. Let's do a little walk around. I have to hold the camera a little bit lower because the truck's lower now. Look at that. So if you guys know any any good shops for tires that I could go to, just get some quick ones, cheap, new, preferably new, because these I have to sell these and everything. So let me know. Put down put that down in the comments or hit me up on Instagram. Let me know where I can go. Another walk around. This thing is freaking low. That's real nice. One more look at it. Jesus Christ, that's nice.